Hello guys. Welcome back. This is Shazex back with another video of tips and tricks. Today I'll be showing you top 10 unique tips and tricks of Clash of Clans, which will help you to build up your village very quickly. And don't forget to check the other parts related to this video. You can find it in the iCard or I'll leave a link in the description. So, before starting the video make sure you like, subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification. As it requires a lot of effort for making such videos. So, let's get started after this small intro. <laughs> 1. Watching the replays of defense log. Watching the replies of defense logs helps you to make you more aware of the defense position, traps placement, your hero's situation and many more. If your base is getting tripled by the enemy very easily, then wait for the other players to attack your base and wait if they are able to take triple also. If they are able to triple your base very easily then you should change your base layout to a new one. So, learn from the mistakes. 2. Traps Position Traps position plays a very vital role in defending your base. The placement of the traps should be made in a way that enemies' heroes are not able to triple your base easily. So always search for the best traps placement. 3. How to get an extra mission in CG. As the CG is currently running I thought of sharing this trick. If you want to get rid of a certain mission just simply select it and trash the mission. 2 4. If you use heroes in the battlefield it shows empty in the quick train section. So, let me show here an example. As we can see we have dropped here the heroes and if we go to the quick train section, you can see it shows empty. So, you can use this simple trick to shock the friends of yours. 5. Wall Breaker Jumps on Jump Spells After the new update the wall breakers are able to jump over the jump spell. Let me show you here an example. As you can see we have dropped here a couple of wall breakers and dropped some jump spells. As you can see here easily some of the wall breakers have jumped over the wall. You can use this simple trick in multiplayer and also in war attacks. So, if you were not aware of this update, now you have known about this trick. 6. You cannot donate super troops with gems. As you can see here, the person here needs loons. So if we go to the gem donating section you can see we are able to donate only sneaky goblins, as they are cooked in the barracks. And I cannot see here other super troops. So, this trick will be helpful as many players want super troops in donations especially in clan war or clan game times. 7. 
Early Ability of the Battle Machine. Using the early ability of a battle machine allows you to boost the machine. And here is an example, as you can see I have dropped the battle machine a little bit further from the base and used the ability. This helped me to destroy more buildings. So always use this trick to get an extra boost. And you will be able to use it again after a few seconds. Eight. Knowing the exact amount of wealth and upgrades. As you can see I want to upgrade my siege barracks. But my elixir is not sufficient. To know the exact amount of upgrades let me tap on the upgrades button. And now you can see it says, 1595,710 elixirs are needed. The purpose of this video is that you can learn of the exact amount of upgrades, that is how much is needed more by using this simple trick. Nine, getting helpful tips and tricks according to the town hall. For this let's tap this icon and then if you go to the community section, you will be able to get helpful attack strategies according to your town hall. Also if you go to the news section, you will be informed of the latest news of Clash of Clans. So, make sure you watch them and utilize them. Ten. Last tip is that, subscribe to Shazex for more these types of interesting videos in the future, and also don't forget to turn on the bell notification. Also hit the like button. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.